everyone happy fossil friday today i'm beyond happy to show you my largest and my personal favorite project so far and that's the skull of the allosaurus big owl a project that's been over two months in the making mainly printing all the necessary pieces which took over 12 days of printing time to complete so let's talk about them as i showcase the painting process discovered in 1991 over 30 years ago in northern wyoming Big Al is a sub-adult allosaurus that lived in the Morrison Formation over 150 million years ago and was 28 feet long and was estimated to be about 1.5 tons. Big Al is a very special dinosaur not only because it's the most complete allosaurus officially described, being over 95% complete, but it offers crucial insight into the life it lived, which was one that was extremely brutal and unyielding. Big Al is the definition of live fast and die young. It died before reaching adulthood and was identified with over 19 different injuries all over his skeleton. Although the number of total injuries is most likely higher, but due to no soft tissue being preserved, it can only be significant. It had severe fractures all over its right ribs and some of its tail vertebra, which had to come from a violent impact on its right side. In addition, it had severe bone fractures on its shoulder blade, hip bone, right finger, and several of its foot and toe bones. The most severe was its middle toe bone, which so that it was broken and severely infected, causing intense discomfort and was likely the cause of his death due to inability to hunt effectively. The main reason that Big Al is so famous and is why I, and I'm sure many of you love him, is due to the 2001 BBC documentary, The Ballad of Big Al, which was a walking with dinosaurs special that focused on Big Al and how he might have lived and how he possibly could have received his injuries, which were all very plausible such as being struck by a large sauropod, potential attack by another allosaurus, and probably tripping over some large debris such as a log or a rock that causes foot injuries. I cannot describe my love and special relationship with this special and the whole Walking With series in a single video, but the writing allowed us to develop a relationship with Big Al as we watch him grow up and go through exciting yet plausible events that could have happened. Along with the beautiful score, a mix of special and practical effects, it's no wonder why Big Al is such a beloved icon within the field of protocology. And here's the finished product. Being able to own a cast of Big Al is such a dream come true that my 8 year old self would have absolutely died seeing. And I'm really happy with the final result. But what do you guys think? Did any of you grow up with the Walking With series? Is there any species you want me to work on next? Let me know in the comments below. But thank you so much for joining me today. Hope you all have a fantastic day and I'll see you on the next one.